Yeah, today we celebrate the International Women's Day. It's a one day to emphasize the importance we have to give to women in all our responses, being development or humanitarian. Women are an important part of our societies, and in the migration context, we observe more and more women living alone or as heads of households to take the decision to leave. It's important for everyone, but for women in particular, to have access to the technology. Um, but we have to recognize that there is an immense gap. 22% of the population worldwide have access to technology today. And if women represent 49% uh, of the society in Nigeria, it means that it's a minority of people who have actual access to the technology. It's important then that we identify that as a solution for facilitating access to information, uh, to facilitate them to, to learn, to access education, to receive information. And in all our response, this is what we should do, being in camps, in humanitarian setup, we have the possibility to install systems by which women can access this information. That's one aspect, but at the same time, if technology will allow people to access information, it's also a dangerous thing. We have to warn the people and the users that not everything is the truth on the internet. And so if they access information, they look at possibilities for migrating, for example, or taking decisions for their future. We need to inform them that they may be manipulated. And so they have to recognize how identifying those users who are trying to pass the wrong information and which will lead them to take the wrong decisions.